Tomorrow on Sanibel Island, a company is expected to raise up someone's entire home and put it on stilts. So all day, Fox 4 anchor Shari Armstrong has been asking how this will work. And Shari, this is an important job here. lifts is called Davy Shoring and they're located out of Louisiana and they're licensed to do this kind of work across the Southeast United States. So if you go on YouTube, you will see the company specializes in rebuilding. You literally see them digging homes out of the ground that they're sinking into. Well, Davy's work ties into new FEMA rules saying a home has to be at least one foot above sea level, especially if you're in a flood zone, which most of Sanibel is right. Their system is like a giant forklift, but it slips under a home's foundation and pops up so crews can install new footing and stilts. A Davy rep that I spoke to today tells me tomorrow's lift could be a strange sight for some of us, but for them, this is a run of the mill job. We've done literally thousands and thousands of the identical houses in Louisiana following Katrina, Hurricane Katrina, um, similar houses up in New Jersey and New York following Sandy, and of course over in Galveston and, and Texas. So you heard him say that they've done these after major storms. It's nothing new to them. Crews have already been near Matt Lachey installing these stilts and lifting homes after Ian. Now, one last thing, Davey says they charge about a third of other companies to lift homes and put them on stilts. We'll keep you updated. In the studio, Shari Armstrong, Fox 4. And I'm sure we'll see